and 1200 meters flags up and they sent on their way from the 1200 meter marker very untidy beginning Satara, what is Sarah all slow into stride they're at the back of the field early on an Arctic princess also amongst the back rank with at your request they're the last four green silks are first sighting the first one to respond the blue of crimson castles are rounded to second Naomi the white cap a lot more prominent today in third position just two lengths off them starlight's handy Mumbo Lyric, then we've got Arctic Princess who got shuffled for a stride or two, La Fista Flyer, Carp Samesi, Rachel's bottled up between runners, at your request has six, seven lengths to make up, Satara towards the back end of the field, first sighting onto the 400 from Crimson Castle, Rachel becomes a big runner on the grandstand side, towards the inside, Naomi's come under pressure, La Fista Flyer, Arctic Princess and Muzi Yeni looking for the three and coming home strongly on the outside, Arctic Princess now comes to Rachel over the last 150 and it's Arctic Princess going strongly out here the last 100 metres and coming down to the post Arctic Princess Muzi and he's on a spree it's number three Rachel's second at your request and Mumbo Lyric in photos for the minor spots So the Gary Rich team, once again the Hollywood Syndicate, Anthony Del Pesh for the Bartlett's, Danica Stud and Muzi Yeni, there's the salute, an Arctic princess, her best distances are over shorter, she won her maiden over 14 with the blinkers, they dropped her to the 1200, she beats Rachel. At your request and Mumbo Lyric, at your request gets up third, Mumbo Lyric, La Fista Flyer, Crimson Castle, Satara, and Naomi was handy today and then faded out of contention. Arctic Princess was very tight for a few strides at around about the seven, eight hundred meter marker, and nevertheless she puts it together. Arctic Princess, the water winter, comes forward, hits the front and hits the front with authority, and Muzieni, he owns the race course today punch in the air and race three back to the studio well, welcome back to the winner's enclosure more jubilant scenes coming out of here from Hollywood Bits Gravel and uh, yep three in a row for Muzi Yeni Quick double for Hollywood bets. How wonderful. Before we go any further, Bosmas is the groom that looks after Arctic Princess, and he takes home a thousand rand. Well done to you. And uh, 500 from Hollywood bets and 500 from Gold Circle. Enjoy your thousand rand. Well done. Congratulations. Go and take care of Arctic Princess. Well done. Well, I don't know what nickname we can call you anymore because you used to be called Nas because you looked like Nas Buerta. Uh, you used to be called Ginge because you had red hair, but you've gone grey. So I don't know what we can call you. Can we call you Holly Bucks? I wouldn't mind. <laughs> well done, Gary. Thank and you, uh, she, looked, she looked outstanding in the, in the paddock, this, this horse. And you've, you, haven't, you haven't had her for too long. But uh, she raced a bit aggressively. But uh, when Muzi asked the question, she gave all the way to the line. Warren, um, I said to Anthony the other day, I want to try on a 1200. She's never run a 1200 because when I put blinkers on her at work, she just showed very good work. And then uh, actually on Thursday, she got cast in the box and she pricked her, her foot. And I was a bit worried, but Friday she was sound. Um, I just want to thank John Buckler because when he, she came to me, I, he gave me a lot of advice about her. Um, she's a bit of a hot filly at home, but she seems to have calmed uh, quite a lot. They tell me you're good with the hot fillies. I used to be, not so, <laughs> not so much anymore. Not so much anymore. But on a more, uh, a more serious note, as I said to Duncan in the previous race, Hollywood have got behind a lot of stables and uh, they're certainly getting behind you and, and you're delivering for them and it's good what they're doing, not only for you, but for the entire racing community. I really appreciate it. Thanks, Anthony, Owen, James. Uh, I can't thank them enough. I really, really appreciate it and thanks for the sponsorship. And of course... And, so and this one's for my nephew, Tristan. You took the words right out of yeah. my mouth. Uh, I wonder if he's able to watch the race. No, because, he's, in the, uh, he's in the air at the moment. He'll be in the aeroplane, as we said yesterday. He had a cracking second in the work riders. He's busy flying to Dubai and then en route to England. And yeah. no doubt when he lands over there, he'll be thrilled with his result. Well done, Gary. Thanks. Thanks very much. Thanks, guys. Spot on. And, of course, Tessa and the whole team that work with you. Merz, 
Al, what a, you know, I, I've often said it, it's a quiet Monday, yeah. but I can tell you the atmosphere is electric because everyone's happy, everyone's in a good mood, and well, not everybody, the second, third, and fourth might be a bit cross, but that's okay, that's racing. Three in a row for you, Muzi. Well done, and a double for Hollywood. Really wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Uh, thanks to Hollywood, really, really much. Uh, used to wear these colors, <laughs> the winning form silks, and it's nice to be almost back at home and being in bright colors like this. And like I said, what great things they're doing for the game. Game came under pressure when COVID hit, and uh, they saved the, the, the game. They kept racing alive, and they kept the stakes alive. So just thanks to Hollywood for, for a great initiative. Just back to this horse, well done to Mr. Rich. Came into the ring quite with confidence, and uh, and obviously Anthony uh, monitoring how the horses are placed. Uh, it was the right type of race, and she delivered. Uh, Muzi, she was in the early stages, you, you, you were jostled up and down, and she yeah. was quite aggressive, but you yeah. kept your cool and you, you stayed composed. But what I liked, as I was saying to Gary and Anthony, she, she when you asked her up the straight, she gave it to you nasty, didn't she? Yes, it was first time riding her, and she doesn't have a gate speed. She comes out, but she's got no gate speed, and then she tends to look to over race. And I was able to, when I got cut off, I was able to go around her, keeping the opening while I'm creeping up slowly. I found myself right behind Warren, and I thought he would pull me right into the straight. And she showed a lot of courage. Did look to hang in a little bit the first quarter, but after that, uh, she put she once she got her mind on the job, she put the race to bed. Well, well, congratulations, congratulations Muzi. We, we can't, can't uh, hug or, or give you high fives because of social distancing, but to your followers, they'll be thrilled. Three in a row, long may the hits keep coming for you. Well done. Thank you very much. Well done again to Mr. Rich and to my agent. He's really been a game changer for me in Durban, uh, Monty Vermutu, and uh, he's done my rides, he's done Smanga's rides, and I think the, the averages and the aggregates will get better this season. He's really been a top agent and all the accolades to him. Well done to Anthony and his team. And uh, well done to Teletrack.com and uh, Computerform.com and to Mr. Rich. He's got it. Before you go, your agent, Monty Racing, you can see the mask I'm wearing today. He's got a runner, Tom Bola, which you're riding. What are you expecting? Could be included in the quartet? I think she's a big runner. Only concern is she might just need it, but she's a big runner. All the best, Muzi. Thank you. Three in a row. Long interview, but we could talk for two hours because uh, what a lovely day it's turning out to be. You see, you've got a busy day and the whole team are here. And well done, Anthony. This, this, this force has won a nice race. Yeah, um, firstly, it's fantastic supporting these smaller trainers and, and uh, you know, we all, the, all the horses are different teams and um, thanks very much to John because I just said, you know what, let's give Gary a chance. You're all part of the Hollywood, so let's give him a chance to, uh, with the filly. And, uh, yeah, very well done to Gary. Uh, uh, she won a good race. It was the right race. It didn't look a very strong field, but come back in trip and he put the blinkers on and she did the trick. I must ask you this question, you know, when you were riding, of course, you had your main stables and, and you were retained by many owners and yards. Now that you're not riding, you're doing something different, but in this glorious game that we so enjoy, you're getting to mingle and to associate and do business with a lot of trainers that you might not have when you were riding. Uh, it, it's, it, it must be showing you a whole different side of things, Anthony. Yeah, and also you, you've got to do things that you believe it's going to work, you know, and no good not doing it because then... Uh, at the end of the day, anybody else can do the job. So you try and do what, what I've learned in the game and what I've had the experience of and to, to, to try and, uh, and, and get us going forward. And it's fantastic that we can support the smaller stable. And, you know, they don't have too many horses, so they, they do spend a little bit more time with those ones that need a little bit more help. And I think with this really it made a bit difference. And, uh, yeah, very well done to, to, to Gary and uh, very well done to the Hollywood Syndicate. It's nice to have a lot of... Uh, uh, we've got Mike aboard and uh, we've got the whole team here, so it's fantastic. Well done. Well said. Let's hope we talk later again. Let's hope so. Thank you very much. Well done. Well done. Anthony Delpesh and yeah, the whole team, James Everett's here. They're all here. They're all celebrating. And uh, to Owen Heffer and your whole team and your whole family, congratulations. Well done. Bumped into... Uh, uh, bumped into one of the Hollywood members this morning at the, at the shop and they said they're hoping for a big day. And uh, they're certainly getting that. But uh, three, two, four, six, and nine are the numbers that you're going to need. Two, four, six, nine. Arctic Princess has got it one and one very well. Well done to Muzi. Three in a row. And uh, we'll come back to you shortly for the running of race four.